here he is, Doc Whipple. I was surprised to see Dr. Whipple has a new TV show. Didn't we get rid of this guy last season? Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. As you know, I use the latest techniques of psychology to aid people with their problems. That means he charges people a lot of money to tell them that they're confused. Today, I am pleased to introduce you to my latest <laughs> patient. <laughs> An elephant? Either that or a mouse with a severe eating disorder. Oh, this is Shrimpy the elephant. Shrimpy, show the people what I've taught you. Hey. Isn't this great? You dragged me here to see a man tell an animal what to do? I'm gonna go find something to eat. As you can see, Shrimpy here has been trained with love and affection. Smile. Or I won't feed you again till August. Hmm, nice spread they put out for the crew. <gasps> You missed three steps and forgot to do the Elvis impression. Just for that, no lunch. Hey, not that it's a lot of my business, but uh, where do you put up with this? If I don't, he doesn't feed me. Looks like he's not feeding you now. Here, have half of mine. Oh, thanks. You know, Shrimpy, I have a guy who feeds me, and I don't have to do handstands or live in a cage. On the other hand, Shrimpy doesn't have to put up with Nermal, or those twins, and Aunt Ivy, and Doggy Tongue. He's right. That cat is right. Wasn't that elephant act great? No. get past you. Sorry, Doc. I was on my break and... Call the police. Call everyone. All units, be on the lookout for one elephant. Description, Ray. Approximate weight, 7,000 pounds. What do you think all this police activity is about? Maybe they're gonna arrest Dr. Whipple for impersonating a human being. I'm going to go visit Liz. I'll see you back at the house. Bring pizza. People who treat animals like that should be treated, well, the way they treat animals. What is it with all these policemen? Hey! Huh? Huh? Who hid me? <gasps> you made a break for it? I couldn't take any more of it. But it's no use. They'll find me and they'll take me back there. And he'll, he'll be even madder at me. Hide me! <laughs> you gotta hide me! Hide you? <laughs> You're a little large, don't you think? Couldn't I go on a crash diet? Hmm, there must be a way. <gasps> here's an old flat volleyball, and here's some black paint. Maybe. Huh? Come on, just a little more. Tuck it in. You're so 
supposed to be a dog, remember? Bark, do dog stuff. Come on, Spot. What kind of dog do you think that was, Henry? It looked to me like part Cocker Spaniel, part uh, Pachyderm. I don't care what it is. I'm just glad I don't have to clean up after it. Al, how many dogs have you caught this month? Well, let's see. Uh, there was that Lhasa Apso. Oh, no, she got away. <laughs> Try none. Al, you haven't caught so much as a Chihuahua in months. I'm going to assign you to something a little bigger and easier to find. Do you think maybe you could find a elephant? Yeah. And I know exactly how to do it. <laughs> I'll sneak you in the back way. No, I don't think this will work. Huh? I'll take you in the front way. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, sure, like you don't have a couple of fat relatives you have to do this with. Is this where you live? I'll try to find you something to eat. Huh? Around here, it's mostly lasagna or dog food. Huh? <laughs> Cody! I didn't mean dog food like that. Spit my friend Odie out right now. Garfield, if you think I'm going to feed your elephant friends, you're sadly mistaken. Three, two, one. Mm. Elephant! It is an elephant! It's Dr. Whipple's elephant! Garfield, he shouldn't be here. I'm going to call Dr. Whipple. <sighs> Don't worry, Shrimpy. We'll find a way. No, I'm going back, I know. There aren't a lot of places for an elephant in this world, except on a stage. <laughs> Hello? May I speak with Dr. Whipple? They're putting me through to his cell phone. Don't worry, Elephant. We'll have you home in no time. You... you don't want to go home, do you? He doesn't treat you very well, does he? Uh, this is Dr. Whipple. Who is this? Uh... Sorry, wrong number. Uh, well, we can't keep him here. I already have one pet who eats like an elephant. <laughs> the cat, as usual, has an idea. This is an article about a program that sends animals back to their native habitats. Oh, you think we should give Shrimpy here to the zoo? Well, he'd be happy there, but unfortunately, he does belong to Dr. <laughs> Whipple. Whoa! I did it! I caught the elephant! I caught the elephant! Huh? Attention, everyone! I caught the elephant! I may be a lousy dog catcher, but I'm a great elephant catcher! <laughs> Sorry, Garfield. Looks like your friend is going back. There you are! You are in such trouble now, elephant! Don't treat him bad, Doc. Mind your own business. He needs to be punished severely. Bad elephant, bad elephant.
If you think I disciplined you before, Shrimpy, wait until you see what happens now. Elephants are supposed to have great memories. You won't remember the last time I fed you, and you're going to work three times harder. No, he isn't. What do you mean? He's my elephant, and he's going to do what I say. There are laws against mistreating animals. I think we better take you down to jail and teach them to you. What? No! You can't do this to me! You can't lock me up like some... some dumb animal! I'm sorry for what I did, but I think it'll be all right now. What do you think will happen to him? Oh, he'll probably agree to turn Shrimpy here over to the zoo in exchange for a light sentence. Hey, this might all work out. <laughs> and look, Shrimpy, Odie got you a peanut. One without a dog catcher inside. Why, thank you, Odie. Ah, <laughs> figures. I always thought Odie was kind of a nut. 